All right, got another game review here. This one was a offensive explosion, and my opponent put up some decent runs too, but that's the squad we went into there. You notice Tony Gwynn, you notice Wade Boggs, Tim Raines. I think this was the Tim Raines debut. I, I think most people know about Tim Raines by now. This, this video was recorded in like, I don't know, maybe late November, early December, so a while ago. I just never got to it. And a couple things to go over. Tim Raines, I think I've seen people like say his swings trash or his stance. I don't know. I think it's preference at that point. I could see I could see it both ways. He's a little hunched over. He's got that weird angle with the bat and the elbow. He's he's a little hunched. Some people don't like that. All right, he gets hit there. All right, Acuna, who I was hitting very poorly with. Um, great card, great card. There's not really much to say about him. Uh, that was a laser. I have Tariq Skubal on the mound. Man, Gary Sheffield is a beast in this game still. All right, he gets to the late sinker there for a home run. His attributes are just insane, man. Like, he's almost got 125 everything. The standing over the plate is not for everybody. The bat waggle is not for everybody. He's got a very quick swing, though. If you can get past his stance and everything, he's solid, man. He can play third base, I think. He can play left, right. All right, up next is Wade Boggs, man. He, this is the best Wade Boggs we've ever gotten. He's so good. He's got such a quick swing. A little hunched over. I can see why you might not want to use him. Give him a try. He's amazing. Like, uh, against righties. That's that's against the lefty. He's got 87 against lefties. 87 power. All right. I, guess, I think he's against righties. He's got like 107 or something. Definitely a lot more. Max contact. I don't know. If you guys are struggling, use a max contact team. It's not just that they have more contact. It's timing windows. Um, usually guys with max contact have really good vision. So more specifically, use guys with high vision. You'll get better timing windows and you'll get more perfects if you're close to hitting them, but you're not. He gets to this fastball pretty nicely here. Yeah, it was perfect. It was, I think he got that one. I think he got that one. That was, that was a good swing. The other thing I try to remember with these high contact guys is exactly, that was awesome. I forgot that, I forgot that happened to be honest. Tim Raines. He does have a good swing, it's quick. Uh, but like I said, the timing windows and, and the mental part of it is like you're thinking to yourself, yeah, he's got high contact. I can't miss the ball with him. It's better than thinking to yourself like, oh uh, man, I really can't hit this pitcher with anyone. And for me, Lizardo was a guy I struggled against. He's the perfect pitcher to go up against with this particular set of players who have high contact and high vision. All right, Tony Gwynn had a nice little slap hit there. I really like Tony Gwynn. Oh, he puts a really nice swing on this changeup. Yeah, that's that's a crazy swing, man. That was incredible. <clears throat> Trey gets some action here. He was killing the outside corner with all those pitches. So I should have, that was the only place I was looking. He was moving the ball all around really well, though. Yeah. Not a bad pitch. I'm assuming he wanted to get it down a little bit lower. Mike Trout's unstoppable, though, man. I went through a slump with him, but he is definitely back. All right, J-Roll. Got that in on me, but he's got one suit on left field. Tony Gwynn, almost an identical hit here with the slap hit to left field. He's known for this, like, both in the game and in his real career. Just those little slap hits. Which is why a lot of people don't use them. They, they don't want... They want to hit home runs and they know that power matters in this game, but you can afford to have a couple guys hit like Tony Gwynn. Uh, now Trey gets kind of a cheapy early hit home run here. Uh, fastball away. Yeah, early. PCI is not really on it that much, but it worked. Turner's just also really good. He gets kind of bailed out sometimes. He's just, he's, he's just good. He's got a great swing and everything. All right, Boggs with a solid swing there. It looks way better when you don't look at the feedback in the bottom left. But the swing, it looks great. He, the max contact guys can get away with those. You know, now I got a guy on second. All right, spoiler, he does get it inside the park home run right here. I don't know what my opponent was doing. Sometimes they just get really bad animations off the wall like that. His other fielder's there waiting to get it, and then he just lets it go, and then Mookie Betts is forced to chase it down. He throws it to third, which that was, that was his fault, but, you know, that sucks when that happens. Anyway, good for Trout. Ooh, just missed that one. Just missed that one. 
And then we followed up with a triple from J Roll. And then William Contreras finally gets in on the action. I think he was one of the only ones without a hit. <laughs> Not a great hit, but it's an RBI too. Hell of a swing here with a lefty, a lefty. All right, not a perfect, but 100 off the bat. We got the PCI there, timed it up well enough. A little late, but it worked. All right, three run home run for Cody. Good swing by him. He starts coming back a little bit. Tariq Skubal is losing his touch at this point. Um, so it's an 11-5 game now. He brings in Sean Armstrong. Not, I, no, sorry. He did bring him in earlier, but then he brings in Evan Phillips, who, um, wanted to see that first, but he, they both, kind of uh, Evan Phillips has had good cards it's this year it's it's not good it's the same way Bruce Star G uh, Gatterall got treated Bruce Star gets lit up now so does Evan Phillips I think not as much movement as they had before William Contreras another max contact guy in case you didn't know that's actually a nice swing there on the slur of a little early but it works all right we get Gerald to third and yeah at this point, we poured on a little bit more. Tim Raines single through the gap. I didn't have that many great. I did have a lot of good hits in this game, but I also had a lot like that that probably didn't deserve to be, you know, hits. But that's how baseball works. You get hits like that in baseball. That's why they say that's baseball. All right. I love when contact players can hit home runs, though. It was 85 power. I, I just wanted to see it again. It's, I, it's gorgeous. So you're allowed to you're allowed to pat yourself on the back for stuff like that. All right. You're allowed to do that. I think that ended the scoring for me. Yeah, that did end the scoring. I had bases loaded and got out with Nick Castellanos, but we do get the mercy here. And um, just wanted to post that. And just show you some of those underrated cards. Tony Gwynn, Tim Raines, Wade Boggs, man. I like Boggs. So there's that.